I request Dr. J. P. Reddy to say a few words uh, about uh, why he got involved, even though he is not very emotional about some of the resources, etc. Thank you. I'm preaching with the choir here. What he said probably applies to people who are not here today, or the who are here. Uh, I believe Hinduism, the all American open religion, it does not exist like and how often you should go to the temple, what days you should go there, and how many days you pray. Does it exist like to make any kind of contribution financially to the temple? You are free to go or come as much as you want to. Hindu temples uh, always are there concept. The Hindu concept is God is all pervasive, is within you, is around you, is everywhere. Hindu temples historically are not only place of worship, but they are venues for festivities and social bonding. And uh, I need to come out and tell you who I am. I'm an atheist. I was born an atheist from the time uh, I know. I don't know why, but I am. And if in some other country, some other religion, when the atheists are to come out of the closet, they can probably stone me to death. Uh, at least we, you know, we are uh, we are a country and where the religion allows you to practice whatever you want to. Uh, my wife, however, is a very deep religious person. Uh, he's part of many personal attractions she had in her life. And even though she would visit temples very often, she prays twice a day, every day, last 50 years we've been married. Uh, and that tells you uh, commitment. And as immigrants here, we want to perpetuate Hindu religion. And uh, building a temple, maintaining a temple is one of the venues for doing it. I watch up close. Uh, Supermanian and several of our friends who gathered here spent an enormous amount of time and money in making this happen. And uh, I believe the, this would not have happened if it's not for the support and time and spent by many volunteers, both uh, in terms of their time and also in better contributions. Uh, I believe that to, to keep this open, to perpetuate temple such this, it takes support from every Hindu in the area. It does not happen otherwise. Whether you were a true believer, you were a non-believer, so in between, I believe you, your support is needed to keep this open. If it's not a religious purpose, at least for the social value for the community. Thank you. Thank you very much for being here, being part of this wonderful spiritual experience. And the temple is a source of happiness and joy. And we have a great vision of making it into one of the best spiritual centers for all. And in that pursuit, we need help as much as possible. We request to support generously. And one of my gurus said, you can be either Lakshmi, or Parvati, or Saraswati. What he meant was, Lakshmi means, uh, well, definitely you can contribute a lot of money to the temple. And Parvati is the energy. Energy in the form of volunteerism, you can contribute through uh, your kind of action-oriented volunteerism. Or Saraswati, through your wisdom and you can inspire people and can contribute. You can be one or all of them. That is, uh, that is a great uh, uh, attribute if you can do all, all of it. And it is said, it is in giving that you receive. And one of the Buddha's quotes I like is, give freely even if you have but little, the gods will bless you. So uh, I request to achieve our greatest mission of making this into one of the prime spiritual centers contribute uh, generously. And I will finish with one quote from Kata Upanishad where Nachiketa Naimah had 
conversation and may we light the fire of Nachiketa which burns out our ego and enables us to go from the world of fragmentation to the world of fullness in the changeless form. So let us be whole rather than fragmented, united we can achieve a lot of things and let us be, uh, let us uh, let the people be a source of joy and let us enjoy it. Thank you very much. Thank you so very much for those inspiring words from Dr. Boya Reddy, Dr. J.P. Reddy, and Dr. Vivekar. So how can I forget that name? Sorry. All right. Just a quick reminder that the food is ready to be served, but not at this time. We have a few more programs which will be very interesting to you guys. Just half an hour from now, which is 9 o'clock, Food will be served at the time. Just stay quick for another 30 minutes. You guys have been such a wonderful, wonderful audience so far. We really appreciate that. So next, we have a, a program here. We're going to release the somnia. It just takes a few minutes. Uh, and the business in order. So while they're gathering to do that, uh, it's my privilege to invite uh, our volunteers. Volunteers 